Assalamu alaikum children, today is Wednesday, 6th May 2020 and uh, today we are going to attempt some written work in our notebook. Today we are going to attempt answer the questions, answer of the questions uh, related to some lines taken from the story. Alright, so before starting that, uh, let's recall that what was the diary yesterday. Yesterday I gave you to learn the vocabulary. Alright, on uh, page number 18. Yes, this is it. Carpenter, car, grandfather, workshop, daughter-in-law. So this was the diary uh, for yesterday. I'm sure you have vocabulary learned vocabulary. Alright, now today we are going to attempt to answer the questions about the lines which are taken from the story. They looked in his room, but he was not there. Where could he, that boy be? All right, these are the lines and these are taken, you see? Yes, from here. They looked in the room, but he was not there. Where could that boy be? Asked Thekla. Who was asking this question? Yes, Thekla. Manfred and Thekla had a boy. Uh, they had a son uh, and his name was Wilhelm and he was missing and both of them were, the couple was looking for that boy. I'm sure you have this story read story because unless you do not read the story carefully, it is very difficult. So make sure that you have to read the story very carefully. Alright, so for this one, <coughs> uh, A, B, excuse me, <coughs> A, B, C, D, four questions are given. So let's see how can we attempt these questions in our notebook. For this one, Please open up your notebook. All right. Notebook. All right. All right, st uh, student, uh, as you can see that, first of all, you have to draw a margin line. You, you have to present your work in a very fine way. Write down day. Let me show you closely. Day, Wednesday, comma, 6th May, 2020, classwork. Unit number three, the wooden bowl. Topic, answer the questions. You see the work presentation and you see that the four lines are four lines. Ko dekh rahe capital W dekh rahe Aap first letter of each sentence should be capital. Aap ne letter formation ke liye lines ka khayal rakhna hai that aap ki formation un lines ke according honi chahiye. And uh, watch out punctuation as well. For example, agar aap ye question write kar rahe, who looked in the room? You will write the question by seeing the book. Aap ye book se dekh ke question write karenge aur notes mein aapko ye uh, jo notes hain, ye related notes aapko mil jayenge. Aapko pata hai, jus app pe aap working kar rahe hain, uske different folders hain, usme notes ka bhi folder hai, wahan pe aapko ye related uh, work mein ye notes bhi mil sakte hain. Alright, so after, uh, you know, at the end of the question, we put this punctuation mark. This is called question mark. Har question ke end pe aap ni question mark dena. Thekla and Manfred look in the room. B, who asked the question? Again, at the end of the statement, aap ne ye question mark dena. Kyunki ye question hai, inter interrogative sentence hai. Thekla asked this question. Of course, Thekla ni ye question poocha tha. Whom were they looking for and why? Again, this is a question, so that's why you will put a question mark at the end. They were looking for Wilhelm. They wanted him to eat dinner. All right, why did Wilhelm ko find out? Kare te? Because they wanted him to come and have his evening meal. All right, evening meal, uh, the meal that we eat in the evening, that is called dinner. And the meal that we eat in the afternoon, that is called lunch. And breakfast is that meal which we eat at the morning, in the morning. All right, where was the missing person found? All right, Wilhelm, unko kaha mila tha? Yes, obviously. He was in the workshop. He was working in the workshop. Alright, children, that's how you will complete your work. And after completing that, this, you have to fill up your index by writing down the topic. Unit number three, answer the question and the date. You see, date, 6th May, topic, unit number three, answer the question. You must have to fill up the index as well. Or you have related notes. Uh, जो है ऐप के जो फोल्डर हैं नोट्स आपको पता है उसके अंदर सब्जेक्ट चूज करते हैं आप आफ्टर चूजिंग द सब्जेक्ट आप उसमें जो है डेट सेलेक्ट करते हैं डेट सेलेक्ट करने के बाद आपके पास वो लेसन आता है उसमें ऑप्शन आता है नोट्स के भी ऑप्शन आते हैं तो आपको नोट्स में रिलेटेड जो नोट्स का वर्क है वो आपको मिल सकता है ऑलराइट लेट्स टेक अ लुक एट द डायरी कंप्लीट द क्लास वर्क लर्न द आंसर and questions unit number three that we have done today in the uh, in our lesson and you have to prepare the test of verbs textbook page number 19 c1 textbook page number 19 
this is the page number 19 you see and this is C C1 you have to <clears throat> you have to learn verbs and you will be asked to underline the verbs just similarly we have this passage mein kiya tha apne passage ko revise karna hai isme verbs hain jo aapne unko recall karna hai aur aapko kuch sentences diye jayenge and you will be asked to underline the verbs aapko kuch sentences diye jayenge aur aap se kaha jayega ki aap un sentences mein mark kare verbs ko all right so that's how you will prepare your test so by tomorrow on thursday inshallah we will conduct our test all right children thank you very much look after yourself stay home stay safe